hi everyone welcome back to my channel hope you guys are all doing really well if you're new to my channel welcome i do a lot of career and personal finance related videos here on my channel so if that's something of interest to you then please do subscribe to my channel down below and be sure to check me out on instagram as well i'll just leave my page here for you guys now as you can tell by the title of today's video i want to share with you 50 successful side hustle ideas for 2021 I receive a lot of questions from people asking me you know it's all well and good you know to start a successful side hustle like I'm ready to quit my nine-to-five job but what are some ideas and what are some successful side hustle ideas that I can actually try and see if it works for me so this video is just for you because I'm gonna go through 15 side hustle ideas which you can honestly start from your bedroom from your apartment Apartment, your house at home and they're very simple very straightforward you do need to be obviously diligent you do need to be consistent with a lot of these things but nonetheless here are the ideas now just quickly wanted to mention that this video is sponsored by SwiftX I'll be talking a little bit about SwiftX later on in this video now let's get started with the first one now the first one is probably a no-brainer but I want to mention it because a lot of people think that you can't actually make money with this and a lot of people ask me as well like how do you actually make money from social media now let me tell you there are so many ways you can make money from social media and that is my first point so having a YouTube channel having an Instagram account having a TikTok, having even a podcast I think social media has honestly just changed the way that we live people are making thousands of dollars just from the comfort of their own home and it's honestly where I see the future heading in terms of you know the Millennials Gen Z heading um, I feel like it's definitely a very sort of sought out career. A lot of people, whenever you do ask them now, they say they want to be a YouTuber, a successful YouTuber. So if you're not familiar with how you can make money from social media, I have done a video explaining the breakdown of my income. So if you do want to see that, I'll leave it here for you guys to check out. Um, I talk about, you know, how much money I've made in the month of me actually, you know, quitting my job, the first month of me quitting my job. And I explain to you the different revenue streams you can have as a social media influencer or a content creator so that's number one number two is and honestly you can do this from the comfort of your own home and if you are specialized in skills like you know video editing design graphics website building proofreading anything like that any freelance skills that you think you've got you can put yourself up on Fiverr or Upwork these are websites for individuals and businesses that need to get help with you know if they're setting up their own business and they need someone and they need technical help from someone they can reach out to these platforms and you can pitch yourself you have a hourly rate that you can pitch yourself at and you can get paid for services like that so um, this is definitely very easy very convenient and you can definitely manage this along with your nine-to-five job as well so if you've got any skills like that then definitely hop onto Fiverr or Upwork and create an account for yourself so that you can start making some extra cash number three is is reselling stuff just around the house now we all you know have been going through lockdown a lot of us are hoarders and we do have a lot of things lying around the house like old university textbooks we've got technology old iPhones old Android phones we've got furniture I don't see why you know if we've got a little bit of extra time during lockdown why we can't you know spend an hour or two uploading these to places like Gumtree if you're in Australia you know Facebook marketplace Place. it's very easy for you to make money this way a lot of people are out there you know they're looking to refurbish their apartments their houses so there is a higher chance for your item to be sold not only that but I think even just having a garage sale on the weekend as well does wonders I know garage sales used to be a craze back in the day but you'll be surprised a lot of people still do hold garage sales and they do make a lot of extra income on the side um, another thing that I want to mention is also selling your old clothes I recently recently jumped onto Depop to sell a lot of my older clothes and things that don't actually fit me but are in excellent quality. Um, I've actually created an account for myself and I am selling my older clothes on there. So another alternative is Poshmark as well. So you can create
create an account for yourself and just start selling. It's honestly so simple, so easy, and who doesn't love extra cash? Number four is in the sort of personal finance sort of field, and that is collectibles and trading. I know I've got a few mates which purchase collectibles, so like, you know, Pokemon cards, Dragon Ball Z, basketball cards as well, um, UFC cards, and they purchase them obviously for a lower price and they do sell them um, at a higher price. So you can make money very, very quickly given that these markets are exploding at the moment. Um, so yeah, definitely recommend checking that out if you are interested in collectibles and making some quick cash. Um, trading as well, I know day traders make a lot of money as well. I used to have a lot of friends working at my nine to five job with me that used to say their side hustle was trading and they make a lot of money on the side. Not only that, but you can actually actually make money um, streaming through video games as well like Twitch you can make a lot of money through that so if you're interested in any of that then definitely check it out this is a good segue into introducing today's sponsor which is Swiftex I've spoken about Swiftex many times here on my channel before as well they are an Australian based cryptocurrency exchange who cater for not only Australian users but New Zealand users as well they have over 260 crypto assets which you can trade with and not only that they have over 300,000 registered users what I love about SwiftX is their demo feature. If you are a beginner and if you were a beginner like me, they have this functionality on their exchange where you are able to play in demo mode and really test out the functionalities with fake money um, around the buying and selling process. So definitely recommend it if you are a beginner and you are sort of starting to get into knowing a little bit more about cryptocurrency. But not only that, their verification process is very simple, very straightforward, literally takes no more than two minutes and it's one of the fastest verification processes that I have seen around. Not only that, but the fees are definitely lower as compared to other crypto exchanges as well and not only that they do have a mobile app as well which I love using um, I was just actually looking at it this morning so um, very user-friendly very simple straightforward to use so SwiftX have been nice enough to hook me up with a referral code for you guys and if you do click the link in the description box down below it is my referral code for you guys to get $10 worth of free Bitcoin if you just click the link in the description box down below and if you are new then I will leave some videos down below as well in case you do want to set up your SwiftX account as well I have done a video on this where I talk step by step on how you can set up your SwiftX account so be sure to check that out as well alrighty guys now let's continue on with today's video number five now I feel like I've seen this a lot over on my Instagram page lately because Australia is currently in lockdown we are in our seventh week of a lockdown now I think it's like day 45 or I don't even know like we still have another few weeks to go hopefully the lockdown doesn't get extended but what I've actually been seeing is a lot of makeup artists hairstylists emerging and starting their own business I've seen a lot of you know female friends around me that have started this and I honestly kudos to them I think it's a great idea if you've got a skill then you can literally start up any business I know a lot of people also have created um, dancing Instagram pages as well where they showcase their dancing skills and they actually offer you know one-on-one -on -one classes tutorials as well and they are charging a fee for it so you can do virtual you know zoom calls um, where you can instruct a class of you know maybe 30 to 50 people or you know a hundred honestly it's endless because it's zoom it's virtual so a lot of people are making money that way as well so, so if you've got a specific talent I definitely recommend making the most of it because you can honestly make money these days with anything. Number six is online courses. We have seen an explosion of online courses recently, especially with a lot of people at home. They want to, you know, pick up a new skill, learn something, grow and develop their skills. I've been seeing a lot of people sell their courses on Skillshare, on Udemy, um, a lot of online tutoring going on as well. Like if you're good at something and you feel like you can teach a class of people, um, I definitely recommend jumping on these platforms because there's a lot of money to be made, especially even with just like, you know, high school tutoring as well, um, maths, English, science tutoring, a lot of kids are going through, you know, their HSC years, year 12 exams. And if you can provide online tutoring services just from the comfort of your own home and at the student's own home as well, then it just makes it so much more convenient. So if you've got any sort of skills or expertise in this, definitely brand yourself, reach out and market yourself to make a little bit of extra money. Number seven is drop shipping. I know you guys may have heard this everywhere. Where it's honestly insane a lot of people during lockdown started their own drop shipping service and if you don't know what that is it's basically where you don't really need to get involved you just need to find a supplier and you just need
anything to market yourself on Amazon or create an account on Amazon and it's things like you know whenever we purchase for example I don't know like headphones cables um, candle holders wedding cake decorations anything at all like if you've got an idea literally these people are making thousands of dollars like hundreds of thousands of dollars um, a six-figure income from drop shipping so if you're interested in any of that then definitely check out some tutorials on how you can actually start a lot of videos are available I think you know don't wait just just go for it because We've got a lot more time than we ever did before, so make the most of it. Number eight is a virtual assistant. Now, this has exploded with the influx of influencers, content creators out there. There are a lot of people requiring virtual assistants to help out with their content creation needs. So if you feel like you've got the skills to help out an influencer with things like, you know, taking photos for them, creating Instagram captions, creating mood boards, things like that. If you feel like you've got a creative flair around those things, then definitely reach out to an influencer or a content creator and pitch yourself and you may get a chance to be their virtual assistant and what better way to become friends with your favorite influencer so definitely recommend that one number nine is facebook ads now if you know how to run facebook ads that is a skill in itself a lot of companies organizations are actually hiring people that have these certain skills and people are making six-figure incomes from this so if you know how to run facebook ads then definitely put yourself up and make that extra bit of cash because why not there are so many courses as well if you don't have these skills if you want to get started then check out a lot of courses online on skillshare youtube do a facebook ads course and you know get certified so that you can apply yourself for these online jobs um, so that you can make an extra bit of money number 10 now i know we see this being said all the time but you can actually rent out your spare room if you're not using it your garage space your car space if you've got like three or four car spaces or even two car spaces and you've only got one car then rent out your second space you can make an extra $50 to $100 a week just by renting out your car space and if you live in areas that are closer to train stations you're more likely to get hit up because people struggle to find parking closer to the stations um, and they struggle to find cheaper parking so if you've got extra space then definitely rent it out number 11 I think this is a great one every one of us has access to our local community pages um, either on Facebook you know maybe even on YouTube Gumtree I'm not sure where you look through this even whatsapp groups as well but you can put yourself up for doing someone's chores cleaning i know that i definitely have someone that comes over to help clean the apartment as well and i found her through the portal that we have for this building that i'm currently living in and she advertised herself and i hit her up and yeah she comes every fortnight to help clean up around the apartment and making extra money and it's all cash based as well so there's things like you know babysitting as well you can do some chores you can just take dogs for a walk as well i know a lot of people are working nine to five and they don't get a chance to take their dogs on a walk so if you've got some extra time to take a dog out for a walk then yeah put yourself up there and say that you are willing to do that because there's ways to make money a lot of ways these days so it's just honestly a matter of doing it number 12 is being an uber driver or a taxi driver um, there aren't many skills required for this a lot of us have cars to begin with you do obviously need to get approved if you want to be an uber driver or a taxi driver um, but you can do uber eats on your bicycle you can do DoorDash. honestly there's lots of ways to make an extra income on the side um, apart from your nine-to-five jobs so if you're interested in that and getting a little bit more exercise in more steps in um, a little bit more fitness into your routine then uber eats on a bicycle I don't see what's wrong with that Number 13. Now this is an interesting one because I feel like a lot of us feel like we've got imposter syndrome. We feel like we're not accredited to be giving, you know, the advice that we do give or sharing our experiences. But let me tell you, a lot of the books that I have read in the past have been from ordinary people like myself, like you, and they are just sharing their experiences, their learnings from along the way and making a killing from it because they've got a book and they're selling it online, an ebook version 
version and this is an actual form of passive income once you've written the book you don't have to do anything else it's just going to sit there and you're going to sell copies and you don't need to do anything for it so if you've got an idea if you've got something interesting to share then write a book and sell it online it's honestly so simple number 14 is setting up a cooking service so what i mean by this is given a lot of people are busy working sometimes they don't have enough time to even prepare meals for themselves breakfast lunch dinners so if you're good at cooking and i know i tried to pitch this to my mom um, because she's an amazing cook and i told her to set up a business where you make the food and you sell the food to people that can't actually spend the time cooking meals for themselves um, obviously the idea fell through my mom didn't go ahead with it but I think it's a great idea if you know you're great at cooking and I know my mom's great at Indian cooking and that was a bit of a delicacy in the area that we lived in so there was definitely going to be a high demand so if you feel like you've got the skills and there's a bit of demand in your local community then I definitely think setting up a cooking service could definitely be a great option and the last one is alterations I know that given a lot of us have come out of lockdown or still are in lockdown I know a lot of people that have been doing knitting sewing alterations I feel like it's a great way to make an extra income on the side if you know how to hem trousers you know how to you know do basic alteration you can learn this off of YouTube as well um, a lot of tutorials are online then definitely there are ways to make a lot of money so if you've got skills in anything like that then definitely put yourself up even just on your local community page just to get a vibe and sense of what it feels like and just take it from there so guys that's everything that I wanted to share with you today hopefully this brings you some inspiration if you're looking to starting up your side hustle you want to get to know um, what some successful side hustles are out there um, then hopefully this has provided you with some ideas hopefully you can brainstorm and just bounce off of my ideas and I look forward to seeing your side hustles if you do start one then definitely let me know email me or drop me a comment down below and add in any extra side hustles that you think I haven't actually included that you have started so that's it guys I'll catch you guys in my next one thanks guys